Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are here for the first time, my name is Amanda Mimi and I am a lifestyle vlogger and a blogger. So yes, guys, I know in my previous video or actually on my poll on Instagram, I asked what you guys would like to see next and everybody said my everyday makeup look. So... Okay, so what happened was I filmed it, but I was not happy with the content. So I thought there's no way I'm going to put this up. So that is why I am back with this DIY video. It's a quick and easy DIY and this is certain to take your deco to the next level. So if you want to see how I did this DIY tray, sort of layout, what what, then do keep on watching. If you haven't yet joined the family, do click the red subscribe button because it supports my channel. Watch this video all the way through as that also supports my channel. So give this video a big thumbs up if you did enjoy it and you would like to see more of this kind of content. I hope you guys enjoy it. I will link as much as I can in the description of box below until next time God bless you for this DIY you will need scissors marble contact paper some glue so this is a glue that you can use on metal as well as some gold handles from a builders warehouse and some felt pads for the bottom and of course your tile so this is just to show you how it looks with the gold handles and where exactly they're going to sit then you need to measure the sides and how far your handles will be. I chose them to be two and a half centimeters from the edge. So I measured the bottom and the top and then lengthwise the tile was 30 centimeters and halfway was 15 centimeters. I marked that to make sure that the middle of the handle would be in the middle of the tile if that makes sense so halfway is 15 centimeters and the handle was 10 centimeters so the 5 centimeter mark would have to be in the middle I hope that makes sense to check that everything was in alignment I just put the handle to see if it would fit that space and if you're happy with the measurements then you can move on to gluing it down so using my UHU adhesive, I just put a little bit of glue on the two dots for where the handle will stick. So remember we said the handle was 10 centimeters, so on the one side and the other side of the 10 centimeters. And that little dot in the middle just shows um, the halfway mark of the actual board. So that's what I used to make sure that it was in alignment. Then I also put a little bit of glue on the handle as well. And what you want to do after this is let that glue sit. So let it sit on the towel and let it sit on the handle before you stick it on. Things got a little messy, so I'm just taking this cloth and wiping off the excess glue wherever it spilt. So after you've waited about two minutes, you can pick up the handle and stick it on to the areas. And once you have stuck it on and it is in alignment before the glue dries, you can have a little bit of time just to wiggle it around and make sure that it is straight. Then you can press it down for a few seconds and leave it to dry. Then on to the final step, we're just going to take four adhesive felt pads. You can get these from Builders, they were 12 Rand, and you're gonna put each on them on the corner, the bottom corner of the tiles to make sure it doesn't scratch any of the surfaces that you put it on. And voila, 